Comrades, the panel has met. Don't know who was on it because they didn't put any names. They go under the name of Labour Governance. I have been expelled. Not tearing it up yet, by the way. It's quite hard to tear. So I have been expelled under special rules. Any others been expelled? Um, Chris Williamson, uh, Ken Livingstone, people I know on Facebook. Yep. Well, I've been expelled under special rules because of the international human rights definition of anti-Semitism. As far as they're concerned, I've shared stuff that is anti-Semitic. Interesting on the misogyny charge, um, I'm quite happy that I wasn't apparently found guilty on that one. They could have at least told me in the expulsion that I wasn't found guilty on that one. So anyway, thank you Labour. I'll give you that much. At least you don't paint me as a misogynist. Well, of course, I'm going to um, appeal to the General Secretary. Of course I will. That has absolutely no chance of succeeding, but I'm going to do it just as a formality. A panel meets to decide these things. In my case, they didn't actually think it was worth hearing oral evidence. In my case, they didn't even seem to think it was worth having witnesses present evidence before them. In my case, they didn't even think they had to see me, speak to me, look at me, engage with me. Nope, didn't think they needed to do that at all. Well, there we go. Little panel expelled under the special powers granted, I believe, to the NEC. Those of you in the party still, be very careful what you say, because if anything can be construed to get you out of the party, you will be accused of anti-Semitism. And it's the one charge that sticks. Yeah. As I say, the broad paintbrush approach. Yeah, it not, not so much the, the little stipple effects on the coving and whatever. Not so much round the window frames. But a nice big broad paintbrush. Paint them all over with this broad brush. Massive streaks. Anti-Semitism. Apparently expelled from the Labour Party because of my anti-Semitic views. I'm no anti-Semite. I'm going to challenge the expulsion and uh, challenge it with the General Secretary. Let me know, seriously, if you are an expelled member of this organisation, let me know how, what happened to you. I want to know. Let me know how the process went. Let me know what your final decision letter was. To my friends in Labour, in particular to Mike Smith-Clare, and to everybody, Wally Bradshaw, and everybody local in Great Yarmouth and Norfolk. You know now that uh, I'm fighting finally my expulsion. You know that I haven't accepted it. But you know also what I've presented to you in public of the evidence. I'm sorry if you think that I'm an anti-Semite. Really sorry if you do. Because speaking out against Israel and speaking up for Palestine and speaking out against Israeli war crimes against the innocent people, men, women and children of Gaza doesn't make me an anti-Semite. It makes me a human being. Being anti-Zionist is not being anti-Semitic.
Anyway, uh, keep me posted. If anyone else has uh, got expelled, let me know when and why. Bye for now. I'll let you know how my uh, appeal goes. Bye.